every two seconds, someone in the U.S. needs blood. It's essential to help patients survive surgeries, cancer treatment, and traumatic injuries. Yeah, Case Area 3's Teo Torres recently met a man who wouldn't have survived a terrible accident without donated blood. Um, if it hadn't been for that blood, my life would have ended at the age of 27. 12 units of donated blood saved Dennis Sellers' life on that fateful night 36 years ago. 1987, I was 27 years old. I was uh, riding home on my Harley. I'd been to the pizza parlor with friends, and um, a car turned in front of me at a 45-degree angle, and I hit the car and went all the way down the side of the car. A young Dennis was rushed to the hospital, stabilized, then flown to a trauma center in San Francisco with a crushed foot, knee, and arm. So the night of the accident, they um, amputated my arm and they spent hours uh, on my knee getting it all cleaned up and trying to put my uh, kneecap back together. After 11 surgeries and months spent in physical therapy, and Dennis was finally ready to get back to his new normal, ready to live his second chance at life. I was back like physically and mentally probably a year, year and a half, two years before I was um, stable mentally and physically and then um, going to school and trying to um, get on track with the life that, that I have now. The loss of his arm didn't slow him down. Life is what you make it. I would say, like as far as the accident goes, um, just don't be a victim. I was a victim for a minute and I got over it and I took charge of my life and then I've been living it ever since. The pictures prove it, from traveling the world with his beloved niece to having the best time with friends in Vegas. He is here because of 12 units of donated blood, units he's paid back in spades. You know, it's an hour of my time that could save somebody's life or, or contribute to save somebody's life. Um, I mean, cost benefit, it's not even a question. In Sacramento, Teo Torres, KCRA 3 News. Just a great attitude there. And next week, we'll be teaming up with Vitalin for the KCRA 3 Blood Drive for Life. And you can scan the QR code at the bottom of your screen, and that'll take you straight to the website. You can sign up for an appointment. The Blood Drive is happening January 4th through the 7th at Sierra College in Rockland, and then January 5th and 6th at the Sacramento Central YMCA. There are a lot of appointments. We're asking you to please sign up.